Well, uh, thank you, Jihan, for that, and we will be seeing you once again. Now, as the uh, nation is experiencing abnormal weather conditions, people are using up air conditioning more than ever to beat the sweltering summer heat. And to prevent uh, them from getting bombarded with enormous electricity bills, as we reported yesterday, the government decided to ease the billing scheme just for this summer. But what is it and how effective will that be? Our Lee Min Young takes a look. There has been a long-standing dispute over the way Korea's electricity bills are calculated. The system is based on a cumulative billing scheme, and some have pointed out it charges users excessive rates. As Korea has been gripped by an exceptionally hot summer this year, the government has come up with a temporary remedy to alleviate energy charges, but it only applies to billings between July and September this year. According to the East Billing System, in the case of leaving the air conditioner on for three and a half hours in a four-person household, users can pay roughly 40,000 won or 36 U.S. dollars less than before. For those who keep air conditioning on for eight hours a day, the rate goes down by 30,000 won or 27 U.S. dollars. The government has estimated that the average household will enjoy a rate cut of about 20 percent. The administration and the ruling party officials have vowed to carry out sweeping reforms to the current electricity billing scheme. We share views that the long debated cumulative energy billing scheme should go through reforms and we decided to form a special task force team and start off the discussion at a zero base. Meanwhile, as the government announced the new energy rate cut, electricity used hit a new record high again on Friday, with the maximum electricity load soaring to 85.18 million kilowatts as of 5 p.m., breaking Thursday's record of 84.97 million kilowatts. The electric power reserve ratio also dipped to 8.5 percent on Friday, marking the fifth time a single-digit ratio has been recorded this year. As a means to cope with this electricity shortage, from Thursday, the government started to crack down on stores, keeping their air conditioners on full blast while their doors were left wide open. Lee Min-young, Arirang News.